Shani Mohammadi is located in close proximity to the Golconda port. A major part of the old Asijai cantonment continues to serve the Indian Army. The Chavani cantonment had been part of the Golconda Brigade of the Nizam's army before it came to be used by the second, His Exalted Highness Nizam's own Hyderabad Imperial Service Lancers when it was raised in 1893. In the closing years of the 19th century, Sir Afsar al Mulk, the Commander in Chief of the Hyderabad Army, was entrusted the task of raising three regiments as part of the native states initiative to provide troops to, for service in the British Army. The Hyderabad Lancers went on to become a part of the elite force which showed exemplary courage and valor when uh, serving in numerous campaigns including the two world wars. The command passed on to Colonel Hashim Nawaz Jang Bahadur in 1895. The unit was disbanded in 1950. The areas of Chauni Mohammadi, presently part of the cantonment are notable for their vast open spaces an extensive teak tree cover. The barracks, tables, and ancillary structures differ remarkably in architectural style from those found in the Sigandrabad cantonment. For here, the vernacular idiom prevails. The International Council on Monuments and Sites, ECOMOS, adopted Heritage of Commemoration as the theme of last year's World Heritage Day. The event aimed at promoting the concept of heritage being, share, being a shared asset of mankind. The theme highlighted the inherent desire of humans to remember and transmit their memory to others. The choice of theme was influenced by the fact that 2014 marked the centenary of commencement of, of hostilities in that dreadful international conflict known is in history as the Great War of 1914-1918 or World War I. Architecture being the most immediately apparent manifestation of our past, successful, successive generations have added commemorative markers to record and transmit their history. At the Chauni Mohammadi, an impressive granite obelisk designed by the renowned Hyderabadi architect Eric Marat marks the exploits, exploits of the second lancers during campaigns in Egypt and Palestine. For the architecture of its buildings, the commemorative marker, and the extensive green cover, the Chavani Mohammadi richly deserves an award in the category of precincts and open spaces. I request Colonel Kunal Sharma, commanding officer, one by nine Gurkha rifles, to kindly accept the award.